everybody, what's up? My name is Becky Fiddler. It's a snowy day here in PA and it's Monday. So I hope you guys are ready for the new muscle functions video. So this week and next week I'm going to be discussing the iliopsoas. And now it is made up of a couple of different muscles. So this week I'll be discussing the iliacus and next week I'll be discussing the psoas. Um, so to start off with the iliacus, I will go over the location of it. I will um, try to give you the best visual description as to where it is located as well, um, which will include the origin and insertion. And then I will go over functions and then finally followed by some exercises that you can use to strengthen the muscle. So let's get started with the location. Okay, so the iliacus originates on the inner surface of the ilium, okay, and then inserts onto the lesser trochanter of the femur and the shaft just below that lesser trochanter, okay. So the iliacus, like I said, the, the ilium would be pretty much your hip bone. It is actually originating on the inside of that hip bone, so not on the outside here, but on the inside. So it is a deep muscle. So if you'd, they are difficult to palpitate. So if you'd stick your finger kind of on the inside of that hip bone, that's where that originates. And then inserts onto the lesser trochanter of the femur. Okay, now that would be on the inside of that leg. Okay. So, uh, now that we know that the location of it is right about our hip area. Now we can apply functions to it. All right. So we're looking at functions such as hip flexion, anterior pelvic tilt, and it also aids in posture. Okay. Hip flexion, okay, would be this. Okay. This is hip flexion. Okay, we're also looking at anterior pelvic tilt. Remember that if you have the pale water sitting upright and you tip it forward so your butt sticks out, okay, that is anterior pelvic tilt. So you have the pale water and you dump it forward, anterior pelvic tilt. Okay, and then it, like I said, it also aids with posture. So we're looking at, you know, keeping the body upright and in the right position. Okay, so now that we have everything in order that we can apply exercises to, now we can come up with exercises for the muscle. Okay, so the iliacus muscle is best strengthened through the hip flexion because you don't want to um, make anterior pelvic tilt uh, too exaggerated because that creates an exaggerated lumbar curve which in turn creates poor posture okay so we don't want to exaggerate the anterior pelvic tilt and we do want to make sure that our posture is good so working this muscle is important as much as it is stretching it as well so as far as strengthening it goes you're looking at hip flexors uh, hip flexions okay so you're looking at anything that raises the leg up. Um, you can do them with uh, bent knees. It is okay. Um, you can do jack knives, okay? And that would be raising your legs straight up. Now you can bend your knees in and do it this way. This way is a lot easier and less stress on your back. As the muscle gets stronger, you can straighten your legs and then do reps like so. Okay, you can also uh, hold on to a dip bar and do the exact same thing with the legs. Okay, so if you're holding on to a dip bar and you'd raise your leg, okay, this works the iliacus, okay, or if you don't feel as if you're strong enough to lift a leg like so, you can bend your knees 
and lift them up like that. Okay? So anything with uh, hip flexing, uh, knee raises, leg raises, jack knives, uh, cocoons, which were the bent kneed uh, raises on the floor that I showed you. But like I said, this is not a list in its entirety. You are more than welcome to add anything to it that you'd like um, or come up with your own. Feel free. So I hope you guys have learned something and I hope you enjoyed it. Please pass it on with a share and hit the like button if you liked it. If you have anything as far as additional information that you'd like to add on to it, please add it in the comments. Um, but knowledge is for everybody. So again, thank you for watching and I hope you guys have a great week. See you guys later.